So for the past 11 seasons, we got a chance to see the ups and downs of Jenny Poulos and Jeff Lewis as they created some of the most beautiful homes in California. And we're happy to have Jenny with us here in studio. Jenny, thanks so much for coming Hi. in here today. Thank you, guys. All right, so we saw that clip. Obviously, you've probably seen the episode before last night. It's got to be hard to watch. Obviously, a, a big breakdown there. Walk us through your thoughts and reactions when you, when you watch the clip there. Well, you know, 11 years is a long time. Jeff and I have worked together 17 years. So, you know, sometimes things come to an end and I'm grateful for all the great memories that we built, not just with the show, but with each other. And, you know, unfortunately, some things have to come to an end. Yeah. There's the saying, sometimes people are in your life for a season, a reason, or a lifetime. And there was definitely a season and a reason. And I wish him the best, I always will. And Grateful for the things that we were able to highlight and the people we were able to help, you know? It sounds like you guys haven't spoken. We have not. Okay. <laughs> yes. All right, all right. We'll but I wish him the best, oh, yeah. you know? Yes. He's yeah. talented and wonderful, and I love his family. And, you know, you, you want to focus on the, the things you can be grateful for, right. and that's what I take from this. That's and say, awesome. thank you, next. <laughs> yeah, you know. Ariana we were, Grande. <laughs> my husband and I were married here in Chicago. That was featured on the show. We had both our children, one through IVF. So highlighting the things that can be inspirational and the beautiful design and the work that we did. Yeah, appreciating that chapter in your life. And is there anything else on the horizon yet? Are you in transition right now? You know, as my friend Andy Cohen says, watch what happens. Oh. Okay. Okay. Stay tuned. Uh, what, are you, there, what are you like itching to do? Do you want to do another show? I want to stay in entertainment. Okay. Yes, in, in many different avenues. So. Were you okay. trying Podcast? to just... <laughs> Signal, I just have to ask, were you trying to signal something there, oh. right there? Oh, no, when no, you signal. Oh, okay. no signal. I just oh, do okay. his theme Sorry. song. I, and I so. read too much into it. No, I watched too okay. much TV. That's okay. I want to stay in entertainment and create great things, and that's in acting, producing, all of that above, which leads me to uh, my hero and why I'm here this weekend yeah. for my, my nephew, Nicholas Contaxis, and his show, Walk With Me. So tell us all about this show. You know, uh... I just, I've been inspired to kind of champion this, this incredible story. You know, my nephew was diagnosed with a brain tumor at 15 months. He's had over 50,000 seizures in his life. Uh, he wow. started painting about five years ago and has created over 200 works. Wow. Uh, he is the poster boy for joy, mm. uh, is what I like to say. You know, he has intractable epilepsy and with this event we're partnering with Cure which is an incredible organization that's just doing groundbreaking research for uh, epilepsy you know 65 million people globally are affected by mm -hmm. epilepsy and Nicholas could never work a regular job because of his intractable seizures so art became his refuge his joy and uh, they made art something that now has become a career for him and we actually have some of his art here you do uh, for our Chicago peeps this is just hit it and obviously inspired by the Cubs, as you see the colors. There we go. So uh, Nicholas is nonverbal, but he is able to speak words here and there. So anytime he's working in the studio and they capture words, we write them down on a board and then we name the paintings based on that. I think we're often, uh, we look up to our parents to be inspired. What's it like for that role to be reversed, that you are inspired, in fact, by him? You know, he just... The thing is, in, in a world where we often are getting discouraged and negativity and unfortunate events and things, we have to put our focus somewhere else. And Nicholas is very sick, but he puts his focus on being joyful, joyful for every moment, joyful for being able to create. He doesn't seem to really judge himself. He just gets back up and works harder. And I think that that's what I just love about being an artist. It's not about being so critical, but just about moving forward and running your own race. Cool. Yeah. So you're so, going to be at Tao for the art show. Tao right? Chicago this Saturday, and uh, it's it's a beautiful. If you haven't check, checked yeah, out Tao Chicago, yeah. check it out. And uh, please go to nicholascontaxis.com for more information on tickets and Cure, which is Citizens United for Research in Epilepsy. It's an incredible organization. So, so cool. donate. Very and talented. I got to say, we're going to tag this really quickly. But you got to go see uh, Hamilton yesterday. I did. And had a connection there too with with one of the I stars. I did of with show. Miguel. Uh, uh, the star and he's incredible mm. and everyone should go see it it was just 
Oh man, I was blown away. I really and you know, I, since I have a little rap in my in my blood, <laughs> oh, really? I even felt better. Yes. Uh, Can you do some or no? Uh, what right now yeah. in the spot? Uh, yeah, yeah, why not? Sure. Tomorrow you're gonna have turkey or ham. I'm kicking it live here on the jam. Oh. What are we doing? Let's keep it going. All my girls, you know what's holding me. Oh yeah. yeah. That was awesome. Oh, that was awesome. We did not prep that at all. That was incredible. You're gonna get on the spot in Hamilton. <laughs> Right. Okay, clearly we're, ha we're going to keep right. having fun. Jenny will be on hand at the Walk With Me Art Exhibit at Tau on Saturday. NicholasContaxis.com. That's where you can find all the ticket information.